My next guest is currently in his ninth season of Chicago Fire, which airs Wednesday nights at 9 p.m. on NBC and is streaming on Peacock right now. Here is Taylor Kinney. Taylor! Uh, hey! It, it is so uh, nice to see you, and thank you so much for coming on the show. I've actually met you before, but very briefly. This was... I, I forget the year. I, 2016, maybe something like that, but... Every year, I, I think I've done it four times, we do a Polar Plunge, which is uh, a charity event for the Special Olympics in, in Chicago. They wait for, uh, you know, in and around the coldest day of the year, and they push some ice and debris out from Lake Michigan. You, you get, your, you know, you get your, your swim trunks on and you, you jump in. And it's, it's gotten bigger, the crowds, but I remember you were there, Vince Vaughn was there, and I remember... I remember you had a suit on and you went say, like just all full suit. And I go, well, how's he going to get out? That's got to be like triple as cold. Look, there it is right there. <laughs> there you go. I remember seeing you. My hair was frozen. It was spiky. Oh, yeah. Everything just goes ice. Yeah. Like, it's, and I'm sure your suit is still probably <laughs> stiff as a board. Out. It's thawing yeah. out. Yeah. It's halfway from Chicago to New York. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> uh, I love that you did that four times. Good for you. I, 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 that's yeah. unbelievable. Uh, it's not uh, surprising to me that, that, that you do these things because you're in great shape. But also, uh, you, you like a good challenge. I know you and your brothers uh, have a, a big grilling competitions with, with each other. How did, yeah. that, how did that start? I kind of grew up on fish sticks and meatloaf and leftover fish sticks and leftover chicken. <laughs> and so it was, it, was, it was always, I just expected things to taste like that. And I was working a lot. I started kind of coming home and grilling on my own. Like, uh, towards the end of high school, beginning of, of college, I would go, I, if I was doing carpentry work or roofing, I started grilling. And then I started with these marinades. And then it was like, hey, mom, like, you actually can make chicken that doesn't, you know, crack and dry. It's actually, <laughs> like, this is delicious. It's kind of good. And so it was a joke with that. And then I, we got more into it, started writing down recipes. My brothers got in on it. And then it became a competition of sorts. And it just kind of took off. Well, you took it to the next level. You actually bought a, a, a restaurant. So I own a part own a restaurant and theater in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. It's called Zootropolis uh, and Lancaster Distilleries. The theater is it's a small theater. We do independent film, uh, documentaries, live music. It's not a big venue, maybe 90 people, 90 person capacity pre COVID. It's helping a lot of people who are in between jobs and, and in and out of work, so. Please and, support hey, your local stuff, yeah. If you ever get a chance, like, come and do a little, uh, a little stage, a little set on the, on the stage there at, uh, at Zotropolis. If you have an open mic, I can't help myself. I have to go up and grab up. <laughs> Zotropolis? Zotropolis is the theater, Lancaster Distilleries, the restaurant. Uh, all right, uh, watch me. I'm gonna come, I'm gonna come for you. <laughs> I would love it. Uh, I wanna say congrats on Chicago Fire. Uh, it's a giant hit. I mean, this is uh, season nine now. Uh, yes. I mean, what wh what is it like when you first get that job and you go, oh, this this could be fun. I mean, let's see uh, if we can do this. Cut to was it ten years later? Now you're still you're crushing it. It's it's still a yeah, major so hit I've, on NBC. It was one of those things. Like I had done pilots before. Either they go, they don't get picked up. It's kind of you know, it's a crapshoot. You don't know. And, but, you know, with Dick Wolf being a part of this and Law and & Order, I said, well, this is, this could have some legs. I think it was one of our producers saying, or a showrunner um, said, hey, you might want to look into getting a place. Not buying, but just, hey, you're going to get out of the hotel. And it's been nine years now, so. Wow. <laughs> it's, I, it's the closest thing is a nine to five that I think uh, that I'll experience in this line of work. Uh, I'm a fan of the show, and I have to ask because... Uh... I used to live by a fire station uh, when I was first on Saturday Night Live, uh, and they are uh, a very honest bunch. Um, do, do you hear from real firefighters who watch and go like, we would never do that? What are you doing? For the most part, it was, uh, it was, it was positive responses, but there, I think in the first couple episodes, they're like, well, you, got, you guys, uh, you put that, you got this hose, you slid down this hose, you're like, how the hell are you going to get back up? We don't do that. What, what, what is that? And still, I was like, hey, it's you guys, a TV any, show. You guys got any... Like, <laughs> it's a television show. We're not really firefighters. <laughs> That's what I said. I was like, there's a little creative license. And they're like, well, that, what are you talking about? Like, no, no. <laughs> uh, uh, Taylor, thanks so much for coming on the show, man. I, I, I'm a big fan. Uh, I want to show Thank everyone you. a clip. Here is Taylor Kinney in Chicago Fire. Take a look at this. 
You all right? <clears throat> Just waiting for some aspirin to kick in. What's up? You know anything about the delivery Stella ordered for the apartment? Delivery of what? That's the thing, she wouldn't say. I don't deal well with change. She knows that. Well, it's her home too. She probably wants to put her stamp on the place. Mm, probably. Hey, uh, you and kid, if it's time for me to move on and you guys need to lock to yourselves, just say the word, I promise. I'm all good. Didn't I just say I don't deal well with change? Taylor Kinney's Chicago Fire airs Wednesdays at 9 p.m. on NBC, and every season is streaming right now on Peacock.